Before we proceed, please note that this video is made by AI, but all the content is manually researched by our team, and it's not AI generated. In this video, we are going to share the details for the error code 53 with the Fallout NV New Vegas. The error reads, Game launched failed, Fallout New Vegas failed to start. As per our research, the error primarily comes to Steam upon launching the game but every time the game shows this error. According to our research, this error can come because of several different reasons, so there is no exact reason causing this issue. Our first fix involves deleting the app manifest file. This file can be found under the Steam Apps folder. To execute this fix, navigate to the Steam Apps folder and find the Fallout NV folder. Inside, you should find the app manifest file. Delete this file, then restart Steam and try launching the game again. If the error persists, it's time to move on to the second fix, verifying the integrity of game files. To do this, close Steam and restart your computer. Once you've done that, relaunch Steam and head to the game library. Find Fallout NV, right-click on it or tap the gear icon, and select Properties. From there, choose the Installed Files tab and select Verify Integrity of Game Files. Wait for the process to finish, then check if the error still occurs. If you're still encountering the error, it might be time to look at your antivirus and firewall settings. Try temporarily disabling these, then see if the issue resolves itself. If it does, remember to enable your security programs again, but make sure to add Steam as an exception to prevent future interference. Our last fix involves adjusting the compatibility settings of the game itself. Navigate to the folder where Fallout NV is installed and find either the Fallout NV.x or Fallout NV Launcher.exe file. Right click on it, select Properties, then activate compatibility with Windows 7, and select the option to run as administrator. To recap, the main fixes for the Fallout NV error code 53 are deleting the app manifest file, verifying the integrity of game files, temporarily disabling your antivirus or firewall and adjusting the game's compatibility settings. Hopefully, one of these fixes will have you back exploring the wasteland in no time. Remember, the wasteland is a dangerous place, but with the right guidance, any problem can be overcome. Good luck, Courier. If you like this information, don't forget to subscribe, it will be a great support. And for more tech updates, visit queries.com.